Greetings, it's Holly, and today I'm filming part two of my organizing mini series that I'm doing. And this one is probably my favorite that I'm filming because I am going to be organizing my Yeti collection. I've like had this thought in mind for literally over a year now, but I finally acted on it where I wanted to collect some of Yeti's non-album goods. So I started with Summer Magic Goods. I'm almost done with that. And then I was like, you know what, Finale. I love Finale. So I started getting Finale goods and it just kind of escalated from there to where I just collected things I liked. I feel pretty proud of myself for how far I've gotten. The last cards that I'm needing are just really rare cards. Um, that I don't think I'll ever get in my lifetime, but a girl can dream. Okay, so I decided I'm gonna just do like a one and a half inch binder. I started out with album cards because like album cards are my priority. If it's an era I like, it's higher priority. Or if I just think it looks really nice, let's get some pages and let's put these cards in there. So I'm actually gonna do it by um, album cards and then non-album stuff. Oh my god, literally the highlight of this entire video, nobody move. We have a complete finale set. I need to look at my computer because I don't know which one's finale and which one's scrapbook. Um, she really clowned all these YR Rebel loves with this set, but literally she ate, so where do we go from here? This one and this one, I think. And then these two are finale. This is one of my favorite cards too. I love this card. Wait, word. Okay, yeah, I'm doing it like that. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I forgot to leave a spot for Sappy. No. Okay. Okay, now moving on to non-album. So actually the 2017 Seasons Greetings cards would go right here. I love how I found 2016 and 2018, but I cannot find 2017 at all. And you guys are gonna laugh, don't laugh. This is a spot for smile box. <laughs> Literally, I want her so bad, like clown me some more. <laughs> But I want the third anniversary cards. I know they're so expensive. I know they're rare. Just let me live in denial, it's fine. Also cause they're selfie cards and like, you know, you never know. What if I find them one day? It won't, but what if? I think this is where peekaboo stuff starts. There we go, sticker, hollow. And then we move on to the Superior Era, Summer Magic. We have two spots for the stickers. And then um, the troll stuff came out. There's gonna be a Polaroid right there. This is the, like the pop-up store Polaroid, I think. And then this is like the event card. So I'm gonna put a thing right there for the Polaroid. And then I'm actually gonna put a placeholder for another card that I probably won't ever get, Miss Pantone Passport. Okay, moving on. Baby Party Wallet is gonna go right here if I ever get her. She's so cute and the back is adorable. I love that card so much. I honestly really like Sappy. After that is RBB. And I only want one RBB card. 
which I secured with Cam, literally. He is a real one, and it's the hollow standy card. Okay, and then after that, like months later, was Time to Love Goods. And Time to Love Goods are non-existent, but I want the Time to Love pouch. It looks like a selfie card. I don't know if it is a selfie card, but it looks like one. I'm manifesting. This is one big manifesting video. Another thing that just came and went. Switzerland cash bee. I don't know why the cash bees get sold for $30. And that alone should make you laugh. Like a cash bee being sold for $30, please. And then we get into La Rouge. I'm limiting myself to selfie cards for this one because like those were the cards that I liked the most. Her ticket holder and her fortune card are gonna go right here. And then I have her photo book card. Um, oh, my friend just texted me about part two kinos. <laughs> if you're watching this, July, no, I did not buy part two kinos yet. Okay, next finale stuff. The hollow and lenti set. I really, really regret not getting it when I had the chance to. Um, we're really ambitious on this channel, so. And we need another page. The lenticular is gonna go right here. I wish SM kept with the lenticular cards. They literally have done them for all their groups except NCT. Don't be shy, SM. Give us lenticulars. Give us lenticulars that we can actually afford. Anyways, <laughs> um, projection keyring is gonna go right here. I ordered it. This is a slot for literally one of the La Rouge Japan venue card. Um, the reason that those are so rare is because they were given at random when you bought albums at the concert La Rouge in Japan and then La Rouge in Japan got a cut short because of COVID so those cards are just so rare now. Last cards is the Trolls denim set so here's her Polaroid and I really want the hollow but again overpriced can't find her we'll probably clown for this card. <laughs> There we go. I'm gonna put the day one ticket right here because I don't know what to do with it yet. So we're done with photo cards. Let's move on to postcards. I only have a few postcard sets, but there's only like two more that I want. And then like I'm done with postcards, which is great. Russian roulette. Oh my God. Literally, I love that these are horizontal too because that is so satisfying. And then Peekaboo, literally one of her best postcard sets. Bad Boy, E-Girl Tees. And then Summer Magic, literally her best postcard set. Like this is her best postcard. I said what I said. I think this was my downfall to collecting Yeti non-album when I bought these. I have a Sandy. Just the one. I'm gonna have the RBB one with me and I want the finale one, but I don't think I'll ever get the finale one, so I just need one page. Now we get on to our 4x6s. Apparently the automatic 4x6 is literally a 4x6. Oh, oh my god. That is so satisfying. Why do they not do that still? Why do they make it 4x6.3? SM, I have so many questions. I have the rookie one, but rookie wasn't on my priority list, so I don't know if I'm going to keep this, so I'm just going to set it aside. And then the last thing I'm going to put in this binder is her sappy flyer. But 
there we go. Literally, the Yeti binder is complete. Let's see how much space we still have. Oh, okay, we're good. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is so fun. And I'm not gonna flip through this. We're waiting until the end of the year collection video. I just need to add her finale A4 into the A4 binder. So let me get that. But truly, I'm so sorry, Yeri. Because there's just only men in here. I mean, man. <laughs> it's just man. And the fact that they're like two of the few idols that were picked through like the Saturday audition or whatever it's called. Ah, like literally, that's so iconic of them. Finale. That was it for my yeti collection organizing video i hope you all enjoyed this video i'm so excited like this collection brings me so much joy i hope you are having a wonderful day and i will see you guys next time bye